Let's finish off the program with a final forego of fulminations on pronunciation. A special reminder here to be on the qui vive regarding the word nuclear. Don't say nuclear. Think of nuclear as a combination of new or new and clear. Say nuclear or nuclear. I'm going to run through the rest of the list quickly. So open your ears wide and prepare your memory banks for rapid assimilation. Schizophrenia is properly pronounced schizophrenia, not schizophrenia. The accent properly should be on the first syllable in the words exquisite and hospitable. Weather prognosticators who tell us about the atmospheric conditions properly should tell us about the atmospheric conditions. How do you pronounce the word spelled P-R-E-L-U-D-E? -E? Don't say prelude. That's a vogue pronunciation. The preferred pronunciation is prelude, with prelude as an acceptable alternative. The pronunciations envelope and envoy are pseudo-French. These words are thoroughly English and should be pronounced envoy and envelope. Don't pronounce the H in vehicle and herb, and don't say zoology or zoologist, as if these words had three O's. Say zoology and zoologist. Also, don't pronounce the extra in extraordinary. The word has five syllables, not six. Be sure to clearly pronounce the H in huge and human. Don't say huge and human. For the abbreviation ETC period, take your time and say et cetera. It's sloppy to say et cetera, and even worse to say et cetera. You know the eating disorder many people call bulimia? Well, guess what? The proper pronunciation is bulimia. This medical term entered the language in the 14th century, and until the 1980s, the only pronunciation recognized by dictionaries was bulimia. It may be disconcerting at first to be the only one in the neighborhood who says bulimia, but I guarantee you'll get used to it. You will also be right. What you probably have often heard called a schism, S-C-H-I-S-M, is in fact a schism. Believe it or not, schism is the first and often the only pronunciation listed in dictionaries. And last but not least, how do you pronounce the name of your credit card, the one spelled V-I-S-A? Do you say Visa or Visa? Visa, with a hard S sound, is incorrect. Say Visa with a soft S, which sounds like a Z, as in visor and visible.